poor sanitation conditions have been a worry for governments in the country. Choked gutters have sometimes been the cause of flooding, killing many in the process. Sanitation sector in Ghana faces a number of challenges, including very limited access to sanitation. Per UNICEF, three out of five Ghanaians practice open defecation, adding that Ghana could take 500 years to eliminate the practice due to the slow pace at which strategies, laws and interventions are being implemented. Walking down the streets of Accra, you are overwhelmed by all the trash that litters the city. To help deal with sanitation challenges in Medina, a suburb of Accra, students of mental and other health institutions in Accra, in collaboration with the Lankwantana Municipal Assembly and Zoom Lion embarked on a sanitation and health education exercise. Registrar of Nursing and Midwifery Council of Ghana, Felix Nyante, advised the residents to keep the environment clean as a preventive health measure. As some of us are actually deserting the gutters, others are engaging the shoppers and the shop owners and the traders and the sellers in health education, basic personal and environmental hygiene, so that we can prevent diseases and illnesses. We think that if we spend just a little effort in health prevention, health promotion exercises, we will we'll prevent a lot of diseases and we'll spend less in curative health services. He was also worried about the recent incident of suicide in the country. Because the mental health nursing school is involved, they are engaging the shoppers and the shop owners in basic mental uh, illness education. We go through a lot of stress and people think that ending their lives is the solution. But suicide, they are telling people that it's not the option. Some residents at Medina Zongo Junction have these to say. So we've been doing it. As a bad, people don't really partake in it. The former government also had uh, these AMA people who do it almost every day, but they stop. I don't know. Normally, Saturday is our market day. Yeah, and nobody can leave his job and come and do gutter cleaning and those kind of things. So if something like that will be gone, it needs to be announced, so especially to the houses, so that we get to know that maybe we need to come out to work to do something. But it seems that they only speak to the, those who are in the stores. So sometimes we in the house, we don't know something like this is going on. We appeal to the government to construct the gutters for us. When it rains, our homes get flooded.